India has successfully put a satellite into orbit around Mars. Despite costing just a tenth of a similar NASA project, scientists have described the mission as flawless. The satellite has launched India into a small club of elite space travellers. Making it to Mars is a huge achievement for any space agency. And by putting a probe into orbit, the Indians have become part of an elite group of explorers. Not only that, they've also created the world's first no-thrills, low-cost space agency. The Prime Minister went on to proudly boast that the film Gravity costs more to make than this mission. History has been created today. We have dared to reach out into the unknown and have achieved the near impossible. In its closest orbit, Mars is almost 35 million miles away, but the Mangalyaan probe travelled more than 420 million miles to align with the red planet. It took 300 days but cost just 45 million pounds. Compare that to NASA's latest mission to put a probe in orbit, which cost 409 million pounds. The Mars Atmosphere and Volatile Evolution mission MAVEN will go to work in orbit. On Monday, MAVEN also successfully reached Mars from recent trips to the Red Planet. Its mission is to study the atmosphere of the planet, to build a better understanding of current and past climate conditions. NASA and the Indian Space Research Organization are likely to share data, as Mangalyan is on a similar mission. And another famous NASA explorer, the Curiosity rover, welcomed India's probe to Mars this morning via Twitter, to which it responded, Howdy, Mars Curiosity. Keep in touch. I'll be around. Some have criticised the money that the Indian government spends on its space programme, when so many of its 1.2 billion people are poor. The UK still gives the country hundreds of millions of pounds in aid every year. But Delhi argues that success in space will boost India's space industry and make money in the long run. Joe Tidy, Sky News.